Hi, it is Ayikam time again. So I have uh, received a message from our Wing Chun friend. Ask me, why do I keep talking about technology and science? Uh, how is that the Chinese uh, have this technology and science stuff? This is a very good question. And I like to share with you the following, okay? It just uh, the night before yesterday, so uh, I met with uh, a few Wing Chun friends, and I show them, I will share with them how is using technology can bring one into state or uh, get one into the proper energy state like the 613, the 13th state, you know, the state because if we talk about energy, we talk about uh, development then we need to talk about state, you know, it's, it's physics, right? So, technology is needed and technology is always there uh, the purpose of technology is to make things easier for us and uh, to uh, make things uh, really simple for us. For example, uh, say 60 years ago, if we want to have some information from Asia, how long are we going to wait for the uh, the letter, you know, you're going to write a letter by mail, sending a mail, or, uh, you know, even if you have air mail, express mail, flying by plane, where the plane is not like today, you have a fly every day, and if there's a weather issue, then you don't fly, those kind of stuff. Compared with today, today, you know, practically in the fingertip. You want information, somebody can send you uh, on the other side of the world in a matter of uh, seconds, you will get the mail, okay, the informations. And so you see, this is how much it progress. <clears throat> and so technology is needed for Wing Chun. We need to uh, you be able to use the technology so that we can uh, cut short our learning to learn faster, to, to know things better. No, again, as you know, in the internet today, uh, if somebody have missing a cat, then right away we can post a photo of a cat and everybody will be able to see it. Same thing in the Wing Chun. If we're talking about a state, we want to use technology so that everybody can know that. It's like uh, seeing the picture or the photo of the cat so everybody know what it is exactly, okay? Instead of having a lot of uh, uh, guessing, okay? And then I uh, have no way to know what it is. That's why we need technology, okay? And uh, with the technology, we uh, invent more stuff and make things even more uh, simple and easy to learn and then we progress that way and that's how Wing Chun is going to uh, proceed and grow. You know, you, you just cannot look back like a, in the museum, you know, antique and saying, oh, this is uh, Yikam's uh, writing and those things. Those things is uh, just some kind of records. You want the technology, you want something to get things uh, move faster and alive, okay? So technology is needed because this is real life, okay? Now as for science, let me tell you what happened. I was in uh, my car on uh, Friday, yeah, Friday, Saturday night, Saturday night. I was uh, talking with one of my be uh, Wing Chun best friends on uh, this uh, this uh, Zen Patriarch 
my Sifu passed away with a, a lot of different disease, sickness. And uh, so uh, my friend asked me, you know, why, why, why he passed away that way? Because uh, he have a lot of uh, superpower, you know, he's known to have the CD, be able to heal uh, sickness, illness, okay? And so I say, you know, being seeing that it actually uh, uh, make me really suffer because it make me question a lot of things. And however, if I don't question it, I will not have uh, what I know today. And, and I will not be able to see what it is clearly. Okay, so the truth is, be it the ancient Chinese or the uh, Buddhism, or the Buddhist teaching, the, the Jain teaching, <coughs> those are all very scientific. Same, Wing Chun is scientific too. Say, uh, Buddha. Sakamoni Buddha, okay, when he was age of uh, 19, because he wanted to solve the problem of human, we all human have. We was born, and then we growing old, and then we get sick, and then we die, okay, and because the Buddha want to solve this problem, like solving engineering problem, that's why he go become a monk, he just go study all the things. So he have enlightenment, he have all those chakra turn on and all kind of thing, energy and, and whatever, chi and everything, right? But he passed away at uh, age 51, oh, sorry, age 81, okay? So 19 years old, he start investigate, research on himself and, and all kind of stuff. He get enlightenment and then he have a... Uh, all this uh, power and the chi and all this kind of thing and, and so forth and the training and practice and he passed away at the uh, age of 81 okay same with my uh, my, my, my teacher the Zen patriarch passed away he have sickness and if you look at other uh, Zen patriarch they pass away too okay well this is reality this is reality and uh, from this, we, we, we have to know that uh, uncertainty is the norm, is the default, okay? So this related to the spiral dynamic tier, <coughs> the yellow tier above, where uncertainty is the, the norm or the default. And when one deal with this, one need to have signs. Buddhism is science, scientific, really scientific stuff. It talks about cause and effect and conditions. Okay. The issue is this. The issue is people, majority of people take the Sakamoni Buddha and make it like a godlike and say, you know, if I pray to you, then I want to live forever. Okay? In fact, the Sakyamuni Buddha uh, in the uh, Vajra Sutra, the Zen Sutra, is saying that uh, one must not have the concept of a uh, lifespan. Okay? So, it means that disregard of who we are, we are subject to life, grow old, sick, and death. So the Buddha died. He got sick. He died. My my Sifu, who is uh, the, uh, the, the 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 Zen patriarch, got sick and died. Other uh, uh, Qigong Sifu, sick and died. So. This is what I face. And 
Because this is the reality what I'm facing. I know, oh, I study Buddhism because I learned the tools how to deal with this this thing, this life, uh, this uh, get, uh, was born and then uh, grow old, sick and death. This is what the tools I learned. I know I learned these tools so that I can deal with this thing. Okay. Same with Wing Chun. The concept of, oh, I want to be number one. I want to be, uh, I know the secret. I can beat other people. This is no different than uh, like uh, people study Buddhism saying, well, I want to have a uh, live forever. I want to prosper and live forever. Okay. Same type of stuff. You will never get it. Why? Because the world is, is change is the norm. Keeping changing is the norm. Okay. And uh, what we learn in Wing Chun is to deal with our own problem. So we need the basis. Okay. For example, I found out I was born with diabetic type 1. Now, well, can you ask Yi Kam or Liang Zhan or whoever have diabetic type 1? Or you ask my Qigong, uh, 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 Qigong, uh, the six healing sound, uh, uh, who is very expert in that, um, uh, Dr. Mali Tang, does he have a, a diabetic type 1? None. None have the solution. But I have to learn the six healing sound, the Wing Chun and so forth. So that I know, I know how to deal with myself. I need to live. I need to know how to deal with myself. And that is where the Qigong, the Six Healing Sound, the, the Buddhism, the Wing Chun help me. And maybe 40 years later, yeah, I'm sure that 40 years later, you will not see me anymore. I died, okay? And gone, okay? So from this energy state, I turn into another energy state. So this Hendrix is gone. Okay? But I need something to deal with it. Now, if this is not scientific, scientific mean to the very general is cause and effect, dealing with cause and effect. Okay? So it, it, it needs to be like that. Well, as a, type, a diabetic type 1, I'm not supposed to uh, do really, really hard training. That means I was born, I cannot be Muhammad Ali. Because my body not allowed to do so. Well, got to face it. And then got to deal with it. It's just like all we human have to deal with. We were born, we get grow old, we get sick, and we die some days. We have to deal with it. Okay? We cannot just say, well, I believe in certainty so that uh, I, I, I don't have to do this, I bypass this. Because we have to live with it every day. So, the same is Wing, Wing, Wing Chun. Okay? It's the same with, with Wing Chun. Do Yi Kong have all the answer for you? No. He have his problem. How about Liang Zhan? No. How about Grandmaster Yi Man? No. Everybody have their sets of problem. Okay? And all this internal art stuff, did anybody, like uh, my, my, my Sigong Ma Li Tang, who is one of the uh, uh, very known uh, uh, expert in Singhi, did he uh, perfect? He do experiment in the fighting and so forth. You can read about him. Okay? He healed a lot of people. But how did he die? He died in the hospital. Hospitalized for a long time. And uh, at, when he was uh, sick, he was traveling a lot. And then in the train, he said that, okay, I'm going to uh, uh, take the meditations. If uh, please not disturb me. Because my chi is now weird. And uh, according to what I understand, it is his time, he cannot ha handle it. And uh, that is the time you go. Like the Buddha, you go. Okay? So all these signs is needed. But, you know, I want, to, I want to warn everybody. 
if you read about the Chinese classic, really, really Chinese classic, there's a lot of bluffing and lying in, 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 in China records, hearsays. Okay. You can read about like people like uh, Nan Huai Jing, uh, the, the lecturer and so forth. And uh, like somebody even said, oh, you know, this Taoist can live up to 800 years old. Okay. Or this uh, grandmaster can uh, can have this chi and get this power. That is actually making up a religion or a cult as of today. So one did not go look into the science behind it, but get into the cult. Oh, you believe me? You know, I'm the grandmaster Hendrik. Uh, you believe me? I, I, I teach you the secret Wing Chun. Have you ever seen this uh, for past 60 years, 100 years, that who have the secret Wing Chun can really stand up in the, in the MMA? Or the guy who is in the MMA uh, 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 competitions or the, or, or the Western boxing competition has to train hard solving their own issue or in like in the Olympic, okay? So when I was young, 17 or so, when I got the riding from Yikam and learning the set from my Sifu So Hong Chai, I was thinking too, oh, you know, I got this thing. You look around, well, China, the Wing Chun world doesn't have this. Or my Si Hing Dai doesn't have this. So I must be, you know, become so good at it, right? And because I need to understand that, I go have to study Buddhism. And I'm very lucky and get a real Buddhist uh, monk teacher uh, who is a Shao, uh, from Shaolin monk descendant, this real deal. And I learn about even the Buddha have to, uh, have to face. Was born, old age, get a growing old, sickness and die. He's the enlightenment one, he did have everything, you talk about the chi and everything. But he passed away 81. At age uh, of 81. Okay? Reality. That make me... It, it, it really hurt. It really make me struggle. Because suddenly you don't see the world as the same as uh, what you think before anymore. Like when I see my, uh, my, uh, my, when I face my, my Zen Patriot uh, uh, Sifu pass away, or when I read about how uh, my Sigong Grandmaster Ma Li Tang passed away, it actually shadowed my confidence. Because when I go in and say, oh, you know, I've learned from this guy, I'll be this good, I'll be this good, because this is the, the top of the world, blah, 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 blah. When I learn about they die this way, it shadow me. But then, but then, that is the one which built my confidence too. Because that is the one make me learn. Oh, this is science. I learned this so that I be able to face it for myself. I cannot be crybaby all the all day long. Okay. So if Wing Chun not going sign. It's going to be cold. You read the Chinese history, you read the teaching of, uh, of, uh, of, of Nan Hai Jing, everything. You can see this. Okay? The Buddha is not promoting this. Uh, Buddhism doesn't promote that. Shaolin doesn't promote that. Everybody promotes scientific. It is that somebody who is bluffing and lying or he don't understand the whole, it, whole, whole issue that he make it into a cult or a religion. And then everybody start to praying that way and go secret that way. Okay? So this is to share with you that it needs science. So now you need the technology, you need science. And for what I can do to, to share with everybody is up to today, the 613.3, so we understand the science behind the entire, uh, the basic of, the, of this, uh, the, 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 the physical, the body, the mind, and, and all this kind of thing, okay, momentum and so forth, in you know, the fighting art, we, we know, okay. With 613.3, we know the healing art, the, the martial arts, 
what is this about? We know the common denominator. With a short strike, sticking body short strike, with the momentum type, with the power type, with the, the, uh, the mechanics, and with the body condition, we know the signs of Wing Chun. And we know how, we know how to do the set properly. And then with the Qi Sao, as what I said, it's a type of simulator to, to practice the, the, the receiving and so forth. And then I'm going to show you, okay, wooden dummy is actually a fighting simulator. Yes, a fighting simulator. I'm going to show you on other YouTube. In fact, whatever the wooden dummy today, we need to upgrade to the fighting simulator or, you know, if we don't like to use the term fighting, we call it a momentum simulator. And using that momentum simulator, we can actually have a real, a, 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 a taste of reality. It's exactly like what, like a, if we want to learn a, to, to, to fly a, a Boeing 747, we, we cannot just hop into the plane and try to learn it. We need a simulator that, that is a better learning tools and it cuts it cut down casualty and so forth, right? So, wouldn't tell me it's like that. And it has to be realistic, okay? A, a simulator has to be realistic. A simulator of Boeing 747 is not a stupid whatever uh, video game. It has its signs there. And then there's no secret. There's only scenarios. How many scenarios? If you're flying this plane, how many scenarios you will face? Or the wind, the tailwind, the turbulence, whole kinds of stuff. You need, you need to, to learn that, okay? So, what I can share with you, offer with you for my 40, 40 years of struggle in this, is this. I just hope that this science and uh, this technology, whatever I have, they will sure be imperfect that somebody in the future generation, which is you guys, go forward, getting better. Like, you know, 60 years ago, we still writing uh, letters, sending by mail, post postage mail. Take, three weeks or four weeks or sometimes never get to the address and today you just have a, a email address you click it within uh, 30 seconds everybody got it okay so the bottom line is technology is needed because we need to do things better faster more effect efficient more effective get everybody become better Scientific is needed because we don't get end up in superstitious or mimic something or get the religions or belief or so kind of stuff. And really be able to use what we learn for our everyday life. Okay? It's not go uh, like in the Buddhist way, oh, uh, because I pray to Buddha, then I never get sick, I live forever. And I prosper too. The Buddha didn't teach that. And, uh, same with Wing Chun. You learn Wing Chun, you're not going to be the best fighter, okay? Or the, the, the learning the secret stuff and, and so forth. You're not. And sure, finally, let me tell you, those who, who, who take Buddhism as religions will not dare to say, oh, Buddha, go study, uh, start at 19, try to solve the uh, the, the issue, the problem of the uh, life, born, grow old, sickness, and death. And then he passed away at 81. They were not will, uh, there to say that because they want to make a God out of there. You know, like Buddha is the God. You just uh, believe on him, blah, 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 blah. But the real thing is not that. The real thing is the science behind it, what we want to know. Like meditation, anapanasati. We know the face of the breathing, inhale, exhale, and the rest face. Is it science? Yes, it's a science. If you don't know that science, you cannot get into the state. So stop saying, oh, this is chi. This is chi. I push you, this is chi. 
The fact is, most people talk about this chi stuff, the energy, internal energy. That is just to use the core power, like the, the body, the core, you know, instead of using the arm power, which is weaker, okay, using the core power. That's what it is. So this is to share with you. I hope that uh, everybody benefit from what I'm sharing with you. Life is a struggle, okay? And uh, to learn all this thing, to have all those tools to help us to start uh, struggle less, that's the key. Don't try to be number one God, okay? And we all have our issue. Nobody's perfect. So this is to share with you today.